All right, and we are back. So uh, we did a lot of uh, walnut hunting in the previous episode and uh, also trying to get the fossils and stuff going. So today is the, the day that uh, uh, it's supposed to be raining on the island. So we can probably hunt for the four unique birds that they keep talking about. Uh, yeah, actually. Uh, so uh, we're just going to walk over here and make sure we have everything stashed, which we do, except gonna keep a few things because they might be useful in the journey let's just check whether I have enough caffeine going on I've I've uh, mine triple shot espresso I think that should be sufficient uh, let's take these seven iridium oh that's actually a pretty good spawn from the uh, machine there uh, let's sell the diamond that reminds me the diamonds could have matured let's just check if our diamonds have matured uh, we can just use the computer actually which is pretty cool so 22 machines really could be anything, by the way, so we don't really know. I would like to see a breakdown of the machines, but this is still a lot to ask for, so it's pretty good. 10 crops ready in the greenhouse. Uh, I think that's fine. We can leave it as is. Diamonds have not matured, so that's good to know. If the diamonds mature, there'll be way more machines. I should I should know, actually. Uh, okay, so it uh, looks like... Uh, the farm is pretty good because in the previous episode we actually did work on the farm before we left. So we left uh, midday. So today we can head off straight to the island at 8 and uh, try to get things done a little earlier. Our goal basically is to get 12, 20 walnuts and repair that little hut-like thing next to the bird. And we'll see what, what it does. Um, so yeah, uh, let's go to the beach. Let's uh, prepare for 8. So, oh, nice. Uh, it's a good thing we came early. There's a bunch of soil here to till. Already getting, uh, like, some stuff, like a dried starfish. Uh, dried starfish is an artifact, right? Yeah, it's an artifact. That's pretty cool. Uh, we can sell the yam. We can sell the seeds. I'm going to keep the clay just because you'll never know when a clay helps. Nautilus shells are expensive. Wow. 8 a.m. This guy is right here. What 8 a.m.? So in the meantime, we can probably do some fishing, right? Let's do some fishing. Yeah. So I actually got this new, uh, what do you call this, uh, bait, which increases the quality of the fish I catch, but I only got a single one of those. It'll be really cool if we can catch the new legend fish with that and then get an iridium quality legend. Man, that'll be so awesome. Um, yeah, because the previous legends that I've all got, the highest I've got is gold because iridium is insanely difficult. And if there is a human being that has got an iridium quality legend, well, man, you are the legend. Uh, you're pretty awesome, actually, if you manage to do that. Very right, nice. We got a treasure chest. Let's see what we get. Wild bait. Right. Uh, I've been getting quite a bit of wild bait. They say it's a Linus recipe, right? So, what is it? Fiber buck meat slime. Well, I haven't really used it much. So, we'll see, we'll see. Alright, it's 8 o'clock. Let's just go in. Let's get to the island. Let's not delete the island too long because uh, there's a lot of work to be done. Okay, so the mission in, uh, of today's episode is mostly... Uh, finding the birds, right? So these birds apparently can be anywhere on the island. Let's just fill our watering can because you'll never know. Uh, so the birds can be anywhere on the island. So let's go around and, and look for the birds. Let's start in the west because in the um, the last episode, uh, the parrot was telling us there's some stuff uh, on the west of the island. And uh, this is where we should be exploring. But there's so many rocks to break and I don't know if all these rocks uh, need to be broken, you know, to find what we are looking for. So, uh, yeah. we'll, 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 we'll try to go through them a little, step by step, a little bit step by step. Alright, let's just cut off all these fibers and see if fibers actually have any luck in them. Mm, if not, alright, let's start with some rocks, see what they drop. I've been getting a lot of Omni Geos on this island, which is pretty cool because it seems like uh, artifact hunting is the new thing. Um, and, you know, it's like it's like we're no longer mining just in the dungeon, right? 
we are mining out in the uh, open world, and it's a whole new ball game. Uh, it's like uh, anything can happen. Oh, I see it! I see it! That's a bird. So, are you one of the birds? Give me an emerald. So, are you the western bird? Um, I don't know. It could be the western bird. Uh, okay. Uh, there, there was one. That was a bird. Uh, we found a bird, and that was unique. It wasn't. It wasn't an ordinary bird, was it? So there's one that goes to the dig site. The dig site is okay. I know where that one is. Uh, let's go to the north and see if there's a bird in the north. Or does it only spawn one a day? Okay. Okay, I don't see any birds there. Right, we are walking past the uh, dig site. I see a little bony rock there. We should probably knock that down and see what it has. Mm -hmm. I, s I think I got a new one. It says skeletal tail. I think that's new. Okay, so, so that bird gave us an emerald, right? Uh, but we don't know... We don't know uh, which tile, I think. Uh, donate. Can I donate that? Wait, what? So it's not a tail for you, is it? Purple flower. So we tried 24. It didn't work. Let's try 23. Okay, it's not 23. So we remember that. It could be 22. We can just go down uh, instead of... Uh, you know, uh, referring, we can just try our luck every time and see which one pans out because counting the flowers will be an insane task, which uh, I don't think we're ready to do. It's pretty insane. Uh, okay, it looks like only one bird has shown up, so that means we gotta come here on four different uh, rainy days. Wait, give me a sec, let me just come down here and let me just. Uh, Till this little nook here. Nothing? Okay. What about this one? Okay, can I go here? Okay, okay, nothing. Alright, just trying my luck because, you know, the, the game is such. Uh, right, so let's go to these guys. Uh, oh, uh, right, it's here, right? Right, it's a little bit, uh, not. Okay. So, I don't know if these are exactly north, south, east, or west. Arrange their gifts upon my door. So, I'm going to put this here, because it was the western bird that gave that. That has to be the beach. Yeah, so I'm going to put that there. I hope it stays there. Uh, Alright, let's go to the parrot and see if the parrot says anything. Oh, the kid is not there. Oh, the kid's here. Right. Five hidden in the west. So there's still five. Can I go up? I can't. I can't go up. Okay. Uh, so it still says five hidden in the west. So I think we haven't explored the west of the island as much as we thought we did, which is really interesting. Hmm. Okay. Let me um, let me go to the west then. Fine. Let's get our radium hole. Add ready and uh, let's see so I'm pretty sure the west they're talking about is this west not the earlier one okay there's a square here is there anything here no nothing um, no 
nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. The woman is not here for once. Let me go in. I can't. Okay. Okay. Okay, what about these? Uh, do these mean anything? Nope. That's a large pool of water here, huh? Wonder if you mean anything. I guess it does not. Um, does watering this help? Okay, not really. Um, what about this one? Nothing. Rod. Nothing, okay. What about the river? It's like a little bit of a river here. Glasses. There has to be some clue somewhere, right? Hidden in the west. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. What are you? Ah, oh, it's a uh, blue discus again. Okay, so um, so it, it looks like we probably have to break these. I think I don't know. Oh wait, there's a little space here. Nice. Uh, okay. Right. So wherever there's like a little space, uh, set and ready. Uh, we probably have to dig that. That's uh, but it said five hidden, right? It's a lot. That's a lot to be hidden. Um, okay. But if it but if it counted five in total, meaning including the ones we already discovered, uh, then it's gonna be a little bit more tricky. Yeah, I think this this plot of land. Definitely doesn't contain any, uh, but uh, it could be anywhere before. Before that, it could be anywhere before that. Okay, nothing there. That one was a neat one. Uh, it's pretty much in the open actually. That was quite neat. Uh, what else? What if I till? Nope. What if I throw a fishing rod? Nothing. Okay. That's the that's the ocean, right? More lionfish. Right. So so I gotta spot those little sp like space between these guys, and if there is a space. There is a chance that there will be a uh, walnut. <sighs> We're gonna take that chance. Um, hmm. This is fun. This is a very curious little puzzle and game. Uh, what about this one? 
No. Okay. This one? No. Okay. Okay. And this door is not gonna open because it's gonna say you need only a hundred walnuts. Wow. <laughs> Wonder if anyone's already done that. Um Oh, hey there. Oh, I'm not wearing the Lime Chama ring. Interesting. Okay. You can take the slime. Slime is always a valuable asset, so. So it's pretty cool that uh, we, we got one of the birds. That's nice. Uh. Here, hey there. Okay, uh, we don't need the uh, sap, so the sap. Aha, uh -huh, there's burn here. Ooh, I heard a creepy little sound there. That's pretty creepy. Um, what about here? What's behind here? Okay, nothing there. There was one here. This little cave, which I've already done. Man, that, that tested my memory. I got it done the first time, which is pretty awesome. Uh... Not found any over here. I've done this one, I've done done that, I'm pretty sure. Then we did of course we covered uh this one there was one here, I think we got that. Which is pretty sweet. Right, it is possible that we have found uh most of the stuff from the island and we just uh, still you know just just like um, have to farm out from the enemies so we can probably go to the cave I think we can go to the cave all right uh, let's stash um, what can we stash in this anything relevant nothing too relevant I think it's more relevant to this there we go hmm the blue discus is new. Covering in sardine. I could check if I have those. Okay, uh, wait, not this one. The blue discus is new. A uh, line fish. Uh, these are oh, these are redeem quality. Uh, got pretty good ones. Right, let's stash the ginger. Uh, let's put geodes in here. 83 Omni Geodes. If we find 20 Omni Geodes, we can start doing the uh, Omni Geode opening. Uh, we'll do that. Uh, slime. Bone. The rest of these seem to be artifacts. Yeah, so let's just pop these artifacts in and then uh, go to bed. We'll, we'll do the next day. Okay. So, leg, tail, the starfish. What else? We got more wild bait. So, let's come over here. There we go. Wait, I got a message? It's a Facebook message. Right, sorry. It's a Facebook message. Uh, oh yeah, the napalm ring. Yeah, I want to test that actually. Hmm. Alright, never mind. Uh, anyway, we're going to do some cave exploration. So, um, it's going to be either the slime and the napalm ring, or it's going to be iridium and uh, slime, and then iridium and napalm separately. So, We'll try one of those. I heard you can unforge them, so it should be fine. It's just that we lose the uh, 
shards from forging them. But that's okay. Uh, shards, I think we can always farm back, so that's cool. Little extra luck. Snow. Fern Islands is sunny. No, we want rain on the island so we can find the the rest of the birds. Uh, yeah. Take it. Okay. Um, gold bar, really? Hmm. Okay. I think you gave me something. I stashed it, yeah, I stashed it, okay. Oh no, none of our, our wine are ready, so that's okay. I'll remember to water this a little more. Okay, um. Right, let's check the computer. Greenhouse is 24, so we gotta do the greenhouse today. Machines have 67, which means we gotta check the diamond. Yep, diamond farm is ready. So today we're gonna be collecting some of these and selling them. And then also doing a little bit of greenhouse before we head to the island. I think we have the time for it. So we'll do that, because we explored quite a bit of the island in the last episode. So there is that. Uh, let's pour a little bit of water for the dog. Uh, R.I.P. Grandpa. And then let's go to the greenhouse. Uh, let's collect these. A lot of coffee to collect. Go. Right. Right. Uh, the trees don't need to be collected so soon. Let's stash these stuff. So now it seems like we have enough star fruit for another Junimo hut uh, but we we won't be needing it because I don't really rely too much on Junimo hut I'm more of an artisan dealer so artisan goods are what make my money for me uh, and of course uh, selling diamonds so um, but it'll still be nice to be able to still make another Junimo hut that way I can expand the rest of my farm because I got like a little tree forest uh, and I don't use it so much. It's just to collect wood. And I realize that I can find wood in so many other places or just buy it. So I can probably clear that part and put another hut there and expand my farm. Or, uh, you know, move some animals or maybe make like a rainbow trout farm to try to get more, um, what do you call this? Uh, prismatic shots because this does seem like the end game thing. Um, okay, let's just convert these regular quality star fruit into seeds yeah let's just convert these first to seeds and uh, let's plant the this one there we go nice let's plant these uh, is that it? Did I plant all my... I think I planted all of it. Nice. So we don't need that. Uh, as for the ancient fruit, we can do our usual selling. Let's go and check on the slimes. I know the new slimes are incubating, so we'll let them continue to incubate. Uh, oh, that's a lot of slime. 100 already. Uh, let's just pop. Oops. Pop these in here. Let's uh, keep the rest of them. Okay, uh, let's check the dinosaur. Ah, new one hatched. Nice. Sell? I'll just leave it as is. Uh, okay, let's see. Uh, let's pop another egg in there. Let's take this silver egg. Let's pop it in here because it uh, the quality of the eggs really don't make a difference. Only the gold one I will probably sell as is. Uh, but I'm not going to sell it obviously because they're so rare that I'm just going to uh, stock them up until I can say I have too many dinosaur eggs. Which I don't think I can ever possibly have. But yeah, today we got to do a little bit of um, farming. So I'll probably end this episode as a farming episode because we've done 
quite a bit of exploration the last time. So maybe maybe I should do that. Yeah, that's the right thing to do. Um okay, let's uh skip you over here. Four eggs. I want to sell off one of my white chicken because I don't use white eggs as much. Um, uh, plus, they it seems seems to have grown up. It's a one month old chicken called Nucky. Uh, sell for two fifty two. How much do you sell for? A thousand Nightwing. Um, Nightwing was my original uh, chicken, the original uh, white chicken, so I could sell Nucky off. Yeah, I'm sure I want to sell him off. Uh, and then let's just collect these remaining stuff. Because the white chicken, the only thing is that they 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 they, uh, they spawned quite often as well, I think, but I don't really use them as much. I sell the regular stuff more, so let's stick to that. Um, I can sell these. I can sell these. These are a lot of money. Rabbit's foot sells for crazy amount. I can sell some duck eggs as well. Let's sell like 20 of these. It's a lot of money. Today is money making day, so we'll just stick to that. Okay, let's stash these up. Okay, what do you have? Um, okay, I have 48 cloths. I may not need so much. Uh, let's keep like 30 cloths, just in case. Um, and let's make this little milk into mayonnaise. Uh, sorry, into cheese. Um, and, and yeah, we can sell these. We can sell these. Sell three of these. You can even sell these iridium milk. Uh, there's a lot of regular iridium milk. We can sell those. Let's just say hi to all of these lovely animals. And let's uh, tell you to the uh, to the selling point. Right, time to sell. Pum, 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 pum. Sell the dino mayo, sell the gold fruits. Right, that's looking good. Uh, let's see if we can put these to uh, to the brewery. Let's get these all brewing. Uh, let's get these in as well. Let's collect these. I'm gonna start a pretty uh, fast cycle it looks like so I can actually start selling these on the go. Um, oh, that's, oh, did I did I actually yeah I did okay. I was about to do that quite fast. Uh, let's just check the progress of the rainbow trout. There's three out of three, so they probably start us demanding stuff uh, quite soon. And I should probably um, prepare whatever they may ask for. I don't really know what they ask for, so I'll see it when I see it, and I'll deal with it uh, when the day comes. Uh, let's keep one of these away. A lot of ancient fruit wine, huh? Okay. Mm let's pop this here. Let's check. We don't have many barrels already, but never mind. There's nothing wrong in stocking up uh, on ancient fruit. Let's also come down here and get the farm cleaned up a little bit. So, uh, I may only stick to two sturgeon instead of four. Uh, because I want to keep other stuff. So, so the last fish that I want to keep is this, uh, is this um, night market fish called a blobfish or something. Which I actually realized that I've never caught. And uh, it's actually, it actually sells for a really high price. So I, I really want to empty this pond as soon as uh, I catch that fish, then create uh, one of those because uh, as much as I like my sturgeon farm, uh, I think I need a more variety. 
So the reason I keep these other fish is because they all served some purpose. I may also get rid of my stonefish. So the stonefish sells for quite a bit. Um, but the blobfish sells for a whole lot more. And selling is not what I really need fish for. Uh, it's just I want to keep them more for rarity and also for what they give. So I realized I already have the ones that sell for the most, which are the ice pip and the lava eel. And then the roe from the sturgeon really sells for quite a bit. So focusing on rainbow trout may be useful, and I can swap the stonefish out for the blobfish maybe. So I should have two uh, rainbow trout ponds. So once the third, once the three pond becomes a four and starts spawning more, I will split them out and then hopefully in the next night market uh, get a blobfish. Let's sell the lava eel so I can show you how much it's worth. I'm going to sell an ice pip as well. You know what, let's just sell all of these because I have plenty of these stuff. Uh, Rainbow Trout Row, Ice Pip Row, Flounder Row. I can straight up sell the Sturgeon. Yeah, I can straight up sell the Sturgeon. And I'm going to just age the uh, Sturgeon Row. The Sturgeon Row is the only thing that's really uh, worth aging because it gives you the most amount of yield uh, when you convert them to caviar, which I can't do right now, unfortunately. Uh, Alright, I'm going to stash my caviar in I mean, stash my Sturgeon Row in here. Until I have enough. Alright, so let's go back to the um, board because today is Monday. And you always got to remember when you play Stardew is to work with the uh, schedule. Stardew is all about uh, the days, right? And uh, it's really important not to miss out on events. And uh, the last time I took a dive in the night market, I completely forgot about the... Uh, the blobfish that I'm talking about right now. And now I realize that I actually have to go back to the night market. Which I'm not sure when it will be next. Uh, but anyway, uh, on 25th Christmas, I got to give a gift to, I think, Emily. And if I'm not mistaken, Emily likes the same thing that uh, Abigail likes. Which is Amethyst. And... Um, I have a lot of Amethyst stocked up. Because I used to simp really hard on... Uh, Abigail, so I should be able to give Emily the same thing and simper out on uh, Christmas. So let's see. And I mean, not simper out. It's just a gift, all right? It's just a gift. I have a wife. Uh, okay, so here, prismatic jelly. I require assistance with tracking down the rare and dangerous prismatic slime within the local caves. Bring me a jar of prismatic jelly, and you'll be duly rewarded. I have not seen a prismatic slime, to be honest. But it says local cave, which means it's probably a new monster. Slave 50 uh, skeletons. Slave 50 skeletons is definitely easier because I know exactly where to find them. Uh, but let me also search for prismatic slime. Or is prismatic slime the purple slime? Is that what he's talking about? Okay, at the same time, let me check what cave uh, petrol gives me. So, um, the prismatic slime apparently, oh, sorry, the, the, wait, let me just wiki this up just to make sure I know what I'm doing because it's like a 50 50, right? <laughs> Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so what I'm thinking is that the bone uh, mission might be better because uh, the bone stuff, the bone stuff uh, is easier to do, and I know I can achieve it. Uh, so I probably should stick to what what I can do, and then later on do the stuff that's a little bit 
uh, trickier. So I'm going to do cave petrol. Um, yeah, I'm going to do cave petrol. Uh, okay, so since I'm, I'm deciding to go with cave petrol, and it's not raining on the island, I am instead going to go to the cave and focus on this. So I will make sure this episode is focusing on um, non-island stuff and let you guys know so that you don't have to spend too much time uh, trying to figure out whether I'm going to the island. And artifact... Can you break a golden coconut, Clint? I don't think you can. I know you're pretty good, but you ain't a professional. <gasps> <gasps> oh, okay, so it's not guaranteed to give golden walnuts. It gives iridium as well. Man, Clint, you are a professional. I am sorry you made me eat my words. Uh, Clint is a hardcore, guys. Clint, don't mess with Clint, man. Seriously. Um, let's till this. Because you'll never know when one of it is an artifact. All right, let's go to the mines and get busy. So we are hunting skeletons, and if I'm not mistaken, they're in floor 70 uh, and below. So, yep, floor 70 it is. And the reason I remember is because uh, I was, I started, started up, started uh, this new patch uh, looking for skeletons because they give the bone fragments, right? And... Uh, as you can tell, the exclamation mark is ticking whenever I'm doing it, uh, which is cool. So you see the three skeletons. I, I definitely will not be able to achieve this one, so I'm going to forget about it. Um, this one, the pirate's wife, right? That's the, that's the one thing which I have not really made progress on. Um, the pirate's... Wife. Mm. The pirate's wife. Okay. So. I, I really am not sure how the quest works. Right, you know what? Let me just go to my um, collections and just go through these. Yeah, I know where the forge is. The forge is, good. is, is a done, done deal. These two I've done it quite well. Uh, okay. And he built a shelter, but where? I've caught a stingray in the caves by the southern southeast shore. There's caves? There has to be caves, right? Signs in the sand, signs in the leaves, huh? The tree near the volcano. Uh, 
always found my way to reach it. Okay. Uh, alright, alright. Anyway, uh, skeletons. So, uh, let's get back to the skeleton task and then we'll get back to walnut hunting. I just realized I'm too hitting everything. My new hammer upgrade, I'm really happy about it. Uh, I hope those who decided to go with the critical are also enjoying life because this really amps up uh, our game quite a bit. Really speeds up the way we do things. Can I one shot you? I think I did. I think I did one shot him. Wow, that's crazy. Hmm. Okay. Alright. Um, so, I am going to hunt skeletons and. Uh, what? I completed the Monster Slayer. Okay, so I completed the Monster Slayer task, which is kind of sweet as an add-on. Uh, but I gotta go through uh, 50 skeletons, so I will come back when I'm at 49. Uh, so I'll see you in the next episode then. Adios.